One of the persistent complaints from individuals who do not own electric vehicles EVs, is the lengthy time required to recharge them, particularly when compared to the quick process of refueling a combustion car at a gas station. This concern, though valid, varies depending on the specific EV and its charging capabilities. However, EV enthusiasts argue that with proper route planning, even long road trips are manageable. This meticulous planning may soon become obsolete with advancements in battery technology, specifically the ultra-fast charging lithium iron phosphate LFP, batteries being developed by Chinese companies BYD and CATL. According to local Chinese media sources cited by Carnews China, both BYD and CATL are expected to launch these revolutionary LFP batteries by the end of this year. These batteries could potentially eliminate the need for prolonged charging stops. The key to this advancement lies in the 6C charging rate of the BYD Blade 2.0 and CATL Qilin 2.0 battery packs. In simple terms, the A6 in A6C denotes a charging multiplier six times higher than the battery's capacity. This means, for example, a 100 amp hour battery can be charged with a 600 amp current. However, the introduction of such high charging rates comes with significant challenges, primarily the need for an upgraded charging infrastructure to support these speeds. The current infrastructure may not be equipped to handle the demands of 6C capable batteries. Without the necessary upgrades, owners of vehicles with these high-tech batteries will not be able to fully utilize their EV's potential and will be limited to lower charging speeds. Additionally, it is important to note that batteries cannot sustain peak charging speeds from empty to full. This will likely result in marketing strategies highlighting specific charging benchmarks, such as achieving 10% to 80% charge in 10 minutes, rather than a full charge in that time. For instance, the updated Zeker 001, which features a 5C capable battery, can recharge from 10% to 80% in just 11.5 minutes. Hello and welcome back to EV's Queen, thank you for subscribing to our channel. We provide the most recent and updated news about electric mobility every day. We're thrilled to introduce three unique membership levels on our channel, Circuit Squires, Tesla Knights, and Volt Sovereigns. Each level offers its own set of exclusive perks and content, perfectly suited for your passion for electric vehicles. As a member, you'll play a vital role in supporting our mission to deliver 12 engaging video updates daily about the latest in the electric vehicle world. Your membership not only helps sustain our efforts, but also brings you closer to the heart of the EV community. While detailed specifications about the upcoming 6C batteries from BYD and CATL are not yet available, insights from Chinese media indicate that existing DC fast chargers designed for 4C rated batteries, for times the charging speed versus capacity, can reach a maximum power of 480 kW and a maximum current of 615A. To achieve faster charging rates, either the voltage or the amp rating, or both, would need to be increased. This is technically feasible but would require substantial financial investment to provide high-rated utility connections for thousands of DC fast chargers. Despite these challenges, progress is being made, albeit slowly. Earlier this year, Huawei deployed its first 600 kW fast chargers in China. Li Auto, the manufacturer of the mega minivan capable of gaining 310 miles of range in 10 minutes of charging, plans to install 5005 c capable fast chargers by next year. This demonstrates a significant commitment to enhancing the charging infrastructure to support ultra-fast charging capabilities. In the United States, Tesla's supercharger network, the largest DC fast charging network in the country, offers up to 250 kilowatts of power from its V3 stalls. While this is impressive, there is considerable room for improvement, as evidenced by other providers. For example, Electrify America has charging stalls capable of delivering up to 350 kilowatts, and Gravity Charging's hub in New York can provide up to 500 kilowatts to each connected EV. The move towards ultra-fast charging LFP batteries represents a significant step forward in EV technology. However, the realization of their full potential hinges on parallel advancements in charging infrastructure. As companies like BYD and CATL push the boundaries of battery technology, the supporting infrastructure must evolve to accommodate these advancements. 
This will involve substantial investment and coordination among various stakeholders, including automakers, charging network providers, and utility companies. While the road to widespread ultra-fast charging may be long, the journey has already begun, promising a future where charging an EV could be as quick and convenient as refueling a combustion engine car. Thanks for watching.